Hey, good afternoon. Dana here, Dana Smith 2816. Wanted to give you a little update on my previous Sportster failure video. The uh, dealer had the motorcycle for 12 days. Uh, they tore it apart. And I want to give a shout out to Azzy, spelled A Z I, who chimed in on my previous video and said that it was a wiring issue. And he was absolutely correct. Um, they said that there's a wiring loop on, this is what they found on my bike, a wiring loop up under the tank by the air box that's routed in such a way that as the bike goes down the road and vibrates and hits pumps and various things that happen to a motorcycle when you ride it, can cause the wire to come loose or get frayed, short out, break apart. All those different things could possibly happen. And when something goes wrong, guess what? It kills the throttle. So they kept the bike for 12 days. They went through all the wiring. They test rode it five separate times. I picked it up Wednesday afternoon and uh, drove it home Wednesday afternoon. I drove it to work Thursday, Friday, again today. Uh, I tried both road mode and sport mode. Uh, wound it up a little bit everything seems to be working fine but I wanted to give all you guys a heads up because this is apparently a known issue uh, there are other sportsters S's that have had the same problems and the uh, mechanic also told me that they've seen this same issue in some of the Pan Americas so if you sportster S owners and Pan America owners have occasion to remove the seat, remove the tank, look at the air box. Please, whatever you do, check your wiring really well. Make sure all the connectors are tight. Make sure nothing is rubbing. Make sure nothing is pulling where it can pull loose uh, because this is an issue on several of these bikes. And when it happens, it will shut you down, turn off the motor in traffic. And that's not a good thing. So please be careful check it out. If you take your bike in for service, ask the mechanics to check it out. Hopefully this has been some help. I am back up and running. And also on a brighter note, uh, my mirrors and my new seat came in while the motorcycle was at the dealership. And I have since put them on and I will shortly be making a video with my new Corbin seat and my new uh, mirrors that I got and uh, let y'all take a look at that. Right now, I just got home from work and just wanted to uh, give you an update on what was wrong with the Sportster uh, before it got any longer and have it happen to somebody else. So thank you for listening. Uh, hopefully I helped y'all out. Anybody got any questions, shout at me. Uh, and I will see you again soon. Dana Smith, 2816, out.